Getting rid of the trash is the number one priority for everyone involved in this strike, and hopefully piles of trash like this will be gone soon as workers return to work. It's uh, like the first day of school, kind of. Sanitation worker Manny Puma says residents along his route off East Lake Parkway were glad to see him back at work on Tuesday. We started bright and early this morning, and uh, the response from the community here in Chula Vista has been overwhelming. It's, you know, it's like a parade coming down the street. Customers are coming out telling us, you know, good fight, you know, welcome back, giving us, you know, water and, you know, juices and stuff throughout the day. After being off the job for a month and dealing with the stress of having no income, Puma says the majority of the union members felt they did everything they could to get better pay and benefits. We feel it's a, you know, fair contract and we're back to work. And, you know, uh, what, what happened uh, last month, is behind us and we're looking for the future. Chula Vista's city manager says city crews will still be dispatched to help remove trash. And most importantly, more than 250 sanitation workers throughout San Diego County will also be doing their part to get the trash cleaned up. For what I hear that the Chula Vista yard, there were no major uh, issues when the employees reported to work. San Diego a little bit different because it's a little bit of a different also type of operation. So there were some challenges there, uh, but our members reported to work on time. Both Vasquez and Puma say they don't know how long it'll take to get things back to normal, but they're all up for the challenge. Getting out every single stop, picking up all, every single piece of paper on the ground, just to make sure that, you know, we're the team that does what we do here and we're cleaning up the city of Chula Vista. At tonight's city council meeting, council members told Republic that they'd like to see customers get a refund. And they also said they'd be asking for reimbursement for the money they spent on cleanup efforts. No word yet on Republic's decision.